gist of this exercise is to imagine the entire history of the universe unfolding in the course of one human calendar year. Given that the universe is about 13.7 billion years old, give or take, that would mean that each month translates to about 1.14 billion years. Each day would be about 40 million years. And each hour would be about 1.3 million years. So this cosmic year begins just after midnight with the Big Bang. And already within the first moments of January, we have the uh, four fundamental forces uh, and the first elements are formed. But all the way through January and February and March and even into April, nothing particularly significant happens. Uh, lots of gas and dust floating about. And then right about May, the Milky Way galaxy and other galaxies begin to form. So then June, July, and August pass with, again, nothing particularly significant. And then we hit September with the formation of our solar system. And then about a billion years later, a very short amount of time in cosmic time, uh, in the next month, the first life, the first uh, one-celled organisms emerge. And then it takes about another billion years, about another month, for the first multi-celled organisms to emerge and the first plants. And now we've made it to December, by far the most action-packed month in all of the cosmic calendar. Now for the first couple of weeks of December, the uh, earliest forms of life are still evolving, still swimming around in the oceans of the, of the Earth, making their way towards more complex forms, until finally, around the 16th of December, we have the first worms. A couple of days later, the first trilobites. On the 19th of December, we have the first fish and the first vertebrates. The next day, the first land plants. The next day, the 21st, the first insects. The 22nd, the first amphibians. On the 23rd of December, the first trees and the first reptiles. On the 24th of December, dinosaurs. And finally, on Christmas, mammals appear. A couple days later, on December 27th, the first birds appear. And a couple days later, on the 28th of December, we have the extinction of the dinosaurs, probably because of a massive meteorite hitting the Earth. And on the 29th of December, we have the first primates. December 30th comes along, and still no humans. And then finally, on December 31st, late in the afternoon, our first ancestors appear. But not until 10.30 p.m., do we see the first humans, or homo sapiens. And now the New Year's Eve party is really getting started, except for that nothing really noteworthy happens until about 11.59 p.m. when we see the first cave paintings. Then a few seconds later, at 11.59 and 20 seconds, the agricultural revolution. 11.59 and 35 seconds, the first cities. And finally, at 11.59 and 45 seconds, that is 15 seconds before midnight, marks the beginning of recorded history.